hi guys welcome back and today i'm gonna show you how to make a augmented reality video recording experience with unity 3d and obviously we are using euphoria for the augmented reality experience so gaussian Reed asked me this question about one month ago but then i couldn't uh, give him any proper solution i found a few uh, plugin but most of them were not free and a few of them was free but they they, they are not able to uh, store that video on your local storage so when i search more recently i found a solution for that so there is one guy uh, kim kim made this asset for unity it's basically a native android application he developed and then that AAR file he exported it to unity and made a little uh, screen recording experience by himself so I tested this one and I found that it's really great and it works really fine so I'm gonna give the github link on the description box below so I also changed a few things on top of this particular plugin I'm gonna give also that link to you that will make your life more easier so let's get started first of all first of all uh, you need to install this plugin I'll give the link in the description box below so when you import this asset you'll find that there is this uh, screen recorder prefab all you have to do you have to just drag and drop it on your scene folder okay so this uh, screen recorder it will just record the gameplay screen okay it's not recording the video feed so there might be a few changes i'll try to update this plugin a little bit so that it record the actual video stream that might be more convenient for a ar experience but for now i have just uh, i'm just recording my mobile screen okay and also you can do a few changes inside of the code to make it recordable for a particular position I think I'll also integrate that one in the next version of this plugin so all you have to do after importing uh, or drag and drag and dropping this prefab you just have to create two buttons one of the button will start your recording and another one will save or stop your recording okay so let's create two buttons first great now you might need a empty game object and create a script here UI manager first of all we will need an MS space uh, called recorder now just create a instance of the class recorder manager so this class is responsible for the start or saving your uh, video file okay Great. now we'll need two methods that will be responsible for the two click event on is for starting the video on is for saving the video so Here we'll call the start record method and here we'll just save the video that is the stop I think stop recording this method. 
so that's all you have to do in the coding section finally to go back to your editor and in the screen recorder yeah, sorry in the in the game object you'll see the record manager just drag and drop the screen recorder on this field and in the buttons you have to add the click events in the UI manager and for the start button put on this start bit method and for the saving put on the save video that's it now let's test this out in our mobile device so let's build this project go to build settings you have to make sure that your uh, the pub sorry in the other setting make sure that your minimum api level is 21 okay because this plugin doesn't work below this api level so Let's build this project and try this out in our Android device. Well, so this is the application. When you open the application and if you press the start recording button, it will ask for a permission. If you press the start now, it will start recording. When you are done recording your video, simply press the stop or save button and it will save the video in the gallery folder. I hope this video helped you. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next class.